Gao King. What not thing to do for a ground man? Very good, sir. We want this to come into the fighter's hands without harm. No mishaps. Must be one of the clinkers. Yeah, Good place to start. What is this place? It's nice to meet you both at last. This is Babylon Alley. Here we make it our business to know the streets and provide children with the opportunity to control their own destinies. Clara, Mr. Green said we might be able to help one another. In exchange for our services, we ask a small favor. Well, why not? 
You seem to have taken most of my money. Why not take a small favor, too? There are several factories about the city that are powered almost entirely by child labor. Those children work long hours with little pay, and most are not permitted even to leave the factory grounds. They suffer terribly. I need you to save them. A small favor. In return, we offer you intelligence. Something you clearly need. No, hold on a minute. I'm late for an appointment. What are these terms? We accept. <laughs> Pleasure doing business with you. Show him how it's done. Push him! Be all right. Thanks, Mr. Fry. Ah, there you are. All that stands between you and Whitechapel is the villain controlling the borough. Kalok has demanded you settle the claim for territory in a gang fight. His loss? Here. I'm sure you can put this to better use than I can. Oh, what's this, Greeny? Assassin Christmas. Gather your allies.
terms and waits for you at the Whitechapel train station. He's bet his train on the fight. No Kaylock. Hmm. No. It appears to be broken. Oh well, at least we have a train now. It's not all bad. Kaylock is dead. Whitechapel is no longer in the hands of the blighters. You now have the chance to join our ranks. We welcome all who would stand up to Steric and his cutthroats. Ah, you bastard! I'd rather throw myself to the tracks than run Bertha another mile for that doughty fall by. Kaylock? <laughs> He's left the station. Mel! Hello, fancy pants. How do you make you I'm Evie be... Fry, and this is my brother, Jacob Fry. Pleased to meet you. I'm Agnes McBean. A delight. I thought I was getting a promotion. I suppose I'm out of work now. Come work for us instead. <laughs> I won't bail your heat. You pay better than scraps? Oh, I'm sure we can at least match that. <laughs> then may I present to you Agnes and Bertha, lady and locomotive, at your service. I'll be in the next car. A hide out on the rails? What an excellent idea. Yes, it all worked out rather well. Now, I would like to follow up a lead on... Jacob? Is this serious? I'm not doing anything until this gets fixed. I believe I know someone who can help with that. I knew you were, Greenie.